that's cool, but for now, video games. I don't know why that took so long to say. Uh, you, Turtle Head Man. The entrance to the labyrinth is past the large workshop, but you can't go through here yet. Wait, what? Why did you phrase it like that, if it was directly behind you? Damn. <laughs> if fighting skills were all that mattered, I could become a craft lord in my sleep. I, I could, fighting skills aren't all that matters. I have none. The opening ceremony is about to begin on the second floor. I felt like I should have known that. I'll probably end this video after the entrance ceremony? I'm very sorry, but you can't go upstairs. Okay. I assume it's the door that's open, but okay. You're participating in the tournament, aren't you? The opening ceremony is in the hall just ahead. Alright, what do you got to say? Oh, entrance ticket, please. Your May? Yes. The opening ceremony is taking place in this hall. Enter, please. Jesus, a lot of people. There are a lot. Must. Oh, I could move. Uh, I can't go anywhere. And the person in front of me is the only person with what seems to be an original sprite. So I guess I talk to you. What? What do you want? I, I guess not. I, I'm legit stuck here. Talk to you? Hey you, who's your guardian beast? I haven't got one. What's a guardian beast? Uh, it's called Summon Knight. Pretty sure the guardian beast is a summon. I have played a game before. Everyone in the tournament will use a weapon that was made with the help of a guardian beast. You'll never survive if you don't have a guardian beast of your own. I think I'll survive. The central tower is a castle for craft lords. Wait, what? The central tower is a castle for craft lords. Okay. Darn. Hmm. We can't go to the third level yet. Welcome to the opening ceremony of the craft lord tournament. Well, this is it. I'm getting nervous. Lubert, the craft lord of Amber. Er. Erska, the craft lord of Jade. And Sakuro, the Craft Lord of Sapphire. These three masters have dined? Hmm. To address you, and you would be wise to heed their words of wisdom. Lubert, you look evil, which I think is a red herring. Welcome, apprentices. Welcome, children of the Craft Knights who defend the City of Swords. Erska? This is anime. I can't tell if you're a woman or not. Today begins the tournament in which the skills you have learned will be tested. And Sakuro, you are in the same boat as Erska, but I'm gonna assume you're a guy. It was three years ago that we lost Shintetsu. Our strongest and most respected craft lord. Is that my father? Plot twist? Three years. Has it really been three? Yup. We gotta snap out of it and pay attention. And are they aware that I'm his daughter? And Shintetsu's loss was followed by the disappearance of Tyram, the craft lord of Crystal. Sapphire. Crystal, these are the minerals we choose. We need to find a replacement for these men to join the other craft lords of Weister. Wait, so we're looking for two craft lords in this? As the guardians and protectors of Parista, the spirit that dwells within the holy soul. A position that has been prepared for one of the apprentices in this chamber. Wait, one? You just said replace these and we will determine which of you standing before us is worthy of claiming this position. The majority of you lack skill to be worthy apprentices, let alone craft lords. Good job, Lubert. Keep red herring. But all of you possess the gift of youth, and a few of you, the potential to ah, that comes with it. You must harness that potential to protect Wystead. 
We must do whatever is needed to fortify the sword. The city of swords. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mmm. Mmm, Papa's kid? Ah, where's my Karen voice? I, I, I got nothing. I should think a craft lord would know better than to have such a flawed opinion. <laughs> and he is too old. How does he explain all the adults in this city who cannot craft with a decent weapon? That cannot craft a decent weapon. Probably because everybody shouldn't be a blacksmith. Who is that? And why is he so full of himself? Doesn't he know how unattractive that is? Hey! Oh my god, Papa's girl right after Papa's boy. The next craft lord should be strong and beautiful, just like me. Ah, another girl in the tournament. Oh, uh, you're happy about this. I hope we'll be good friends. And I got no idea on what your gender is. He looks like all these worry warts. I'm guaranteed to win the tournament. I'm not going to keep up with all these voices. That kid must be the youngest one in the tournament. I hope he, oh, doesn't get hurt. But I need to stop letting my mind wander and start listening to the craft lords. Let they stop for us to have that, but whatever. I forgot your voice already. <clears throat> Sakuro, to test your skill and to see which of you is worthy of becoming a craft lord, you are allowed to fight only with weapons that you have crafted yourself. A battle is won when your opponent yields to you and when your weapon or when your weapon breaks. That sounds easy enough. I know I can craft a strong enough weapon. Wait, what? Uh, a weapon strong enough to see me through. I'll prove to everyone in Wystone that I'm worthy of being the next craft lord even though I showed up to the entrance without a weapon. We will allow your master to aid you in forging... Why? You just said we have to craft it ourselves, and the other kids said I need to craft it using a guardian spirit. We will also allow you to retreat, receive assistance during your battles, but only one partner is allowed to accompany you into combat. A partner? I bet he's referring to a guardian beast. I wonder how many of these people have one, probably all the ones that are unique. All of you are hereby granted passage into the dungeon in the central tower. There you can collect material with which to craft your weapon. The person who possesses the key to the dungeon... Wait. The person who possesses the key to the dungeon will bring one to each of you. Ah, keys! I missed an S there. The dungeon at the central tower leads to the shrine of Parista. I've heard stories of summoned creatures that were summoned to protect Parista and no longer listen to their masters. There are many dangers in this dungeon. Placed there to ensure the safety of the great Parista. These dangers will not be lessened or removed for you. We filled it with demons to protect our sacred relic. You will have to confront them and overcome them on your own. We want you to defeat the demons we place to protect our sacred relic. If you cannot defend yourself, you are not worthy of being in this tournament. What about the last guy that enters and just waits for everybody else to clean house? As for who you will fight in each round of the tournament. I, I lost the narrative. Your opponent will be announced by the central tower before the start of your battle. Oh. So we won't know who we're fighting until the last minute. That seems like a strange way to arrange the tournament. No, it doesn't. You must always remember the Crafts Knight Code. A sword is not strength. A sword is not skill. A sword is not fellowship. It is an extension of one's arm. Let the code guide your efforts. They will be rewarded. Friendships will be forged in the heat of battle. When your skill is sharpest and your weapon is deadliest, you will be your own master. I sincerely hope that one of you will become our equal and join us as a craft lord. Thanks, Sakuro. That is all. The ceremony is complete, said the narrator. 
That's it? Oh my god, freaking analog stick. Uh, I don't know how long that's been, but I guess I'll save the game.